All right, hello, hello, danger noodles. I'm not connected to the internet, but okay. God damn it, Yangoose. Fucking area surrounded by Pokemon. Yeah. What do you thought, Rock Yangoose? Use for fire. Side. Did I run out of an ingredient? Here it is. Damn piece of shit. Think you can hide from me. Perfect. Perfect sandwich.
All right. Ah, new one. Get over here, bitch. Oh, shit. Wait. My dumb has did it again. There it goes. That's <laughs> lemon. So we must wipe out all the camel kind just to get one that's differently colored. Target. God damn it. God damn it, Lemon. Why are they inside of each other? <laughs> This, but I could. Right here. You. Right there. It's not interfering with anything. I don't think it is. So yeah, now we got that again. Yes, we gotta murder them. Lemon, they must face death. Damn it, Lemon, you let that Numo get away.
going. Just going, just going, 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 going. Until you get the shiny. Damn it. Lemon. Shit, I didn't even realize my Pokemon- I was being surrounded by a Pokemon. Killed him. See, there's one down here. Yes, you cannot escape. You will face a fate Lemon gives you. Stop killing random Pokemon. Lemon. What's wrong with you? Baby, how do you feel about that, Lemon? Huh? What the fuck did I walk in on? Oh, hi, Hatchet. <laughs> I walk in, and the first thing I hear is, You just killed a random baby. How do you feel about that, Lemon? <laughs> what the fucking hell did Lemon do? He killed the ostrich Pokemon's pre evolution. Oh. Instead of a Numel. That's a suck. So how are you, Hatchet? I'm decent. My, my head hurts like normal. Uh, I'm fine. <laughs> wow. Lemon sure slayed that ass. <laughs> Killed the uh, uh, killed the donkey Pokemon Mud Bray. I see. Okay. Who? Hmm? 
who who joins? Oh, it's Dragon. I can't believe that you're defending the Northern Pike. I'm I'm sorry. What? Yeah, I will. I will defend the Northern Pike. The fish is being canceled for homophobia. What? I think that I think that the allegations <laughs> are incorrect, as was demonstrated by the extremely robust de debunk of it that the Northern Pike has uh, put up. What? Uh, I have to read this dispute. I I'm no, sorry. That what is the fuck's going on? <laughs> Okay, so I sent I sent Hatchet a meme I found on Tumblr from a marine biologist that is cancel culture comes for the northern pike and has an X over the northern pike. Um and then Hatchet goes, "Bruh, why is the north uh, why is the pike getting canceled, which is wrong because it's the northern hike, uh, pike and the, the northern pike is different than the southern pike." And thus yes. you're you're yes. going over yes. all pikes. Even yes. though it's only the north, uh, the northern Child. pike. Child, one, I was tired, and two, when I said the pike, I was referring to the northern pike. Yeah, but you know, whatever. Uh, and then Hatchet goes, "Listen, whatever allegations the allegations are, I am sure he is innocent. All it took is a, a cursory Google search, and I found his response." It to the situation, and then it's the northern pike. Say very zoom. It's the same image, actually. I think. Yeah, that's yeah, the, same the same image. image. Yeah, I, I sent it's my just, northern no. pike meme. I can't believe that's the same image. I mean, it's a pretty like it's pretty much the first image you find if you search up northern pike. Or I should say, it's the first really high quality image you find. Hmm. Lemon. I'm trying to. <laughs> lemon. <laughs> I. God damn it, Lemon. Right. Right. I think you need to sign Lemon up for therapy. You know what's actually really fucked up now, Hatchet? In the, po mm -hmm. in the Pokemon world? There's a bunch of Ghastlies, which are ghost Pokemon. Yeah, I killed a lot of children. Okay. <laughs> There's what? no taking that statement back. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 1984, the child. No. Also, I'm making a Google Docs of my uh, hatching children. What? <laughs> You heard me, bitch. Since when do you have children? I have many penguin children. They're not. They're not regional. Uh, they're. They're. They're not. Uh, it's for the region. So I am creating an invasive species. Yay! I love creating invasive species to Spain. Just a just a standard day over here for the for the child. Why did Lemon just stare at you? Don't worry about it. I feel like Lemon's only doing this to pay for child support. He doesn't have to pay for child support since he no one knows what happened to the Godzilla children. Did you did you old yeller? The Godzilla children. Uh, I traded them off somewhere. So you sold them into slavery? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You, you took about. them to Pal World? That's kind of fucked up. I did not do that. You you did that. We know your sins. No, they went to Japan. I feel like. I feel like that's worse. I feel like you're just- you're gonna make them into soup. What the fuck, dragon? You're making them into soup! <laughs> you're gonna can the Godzilla children. Literally. 
Actually, glad to come come onto the stream now, Hatchet. My head hurts. Oh. Apparently, did you know hot showers are supposedly really good for when it comes to like alleviating headaches? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a char cadet. It has a really terrible shiny. I know. I told. I told you it has a terrible shiny. Kill the child. <laughs> Lemon yes. had. Lemon did not <laughs> hesitate. Lemon kills children. That's why. Also, Mud Boy has a really oh. good shiny. That's why Lemon goes yeah, to orphanages. Oh. How does one spell cannibal? Why are you looking up cannibal? Uh, I am... Um... Uh... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I am reworking my Skyrim mod load order. And one of the mods that I like having is Cannibal Draugr of, St of Solstheim. Because it's not only more lore accurate, but I like the touch of detail that the original lore surrounding Draugr were a bit more uh, inspired by actual Draugr myths. Uh. Nerd. That's Pika's job. <laughs> Very cool, though, honestly. Uh, how the, what the fuck is the baby that I'm trying to make shiny called? Bridgebacks? I think it's Bridgebacks. It's Bridgebacks. Dragon, I know how you can make it shiny. No. You don't even know what I was gonna say. No. It's gonna be something incredibly inhumane, so no. You just grab the baby, get a bunch of glue, no. wipe them with glue, and... Dump them in a glitter bin. It works. Right. I get that that's how <laughs> you were born. But that is not what I'm doing to my poor dragon child. I feel like Bright is like, what happens when you put the Joker into the fucked up chemicals that he went into, but instead of making him the Joker, you just get Bright and all of her quirks. I like fire. Oh, Pyromaniac. <laughs> Pyromaniac trans woman Joker. That's what you <laughs> remember what they took from us. <laughs> I don't get the, the context joke. of that. They they turned the Joker into into a pyromaniac trans woman. Remember what they took from us. They're actually... I don't I don't know. I don't again I don't understand. Hey, did you know it's that... a joke? Oh. Uh, go ahead. I was gonna say, did you know that at times the Joker actually saved Batman? Yeah, because yeah. they're fucking gay. As well as the other villains. Have you seen the Joker? That motherfucker's fruity as fuck. Along with the heinous criminal that should be shot on sight, but also fruity as fuck. Oh, Batman. Have you heard of the trolley problem? <laughs> The differences between some people's iterations of the Joker in the comics is so fucking wild. 
It's like some comics, it, it, the Joker's just a silly, silly little goofy, you know, domestic terrorist, you know? And then in others, uh, he does unspeakable, unfathomable sins against humanity for no reason besides to drive another man insane. Sounds normal to me. You're also, like, insane. So I don't think we should be taking your word on what is and isn't sane. Also, he turned- uh, also in one comic, Joker turned Harley Quinn into a fucking constellation of stars. Sorry, what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not joking. I wish I was. I'm not. Yeah, in one comic run, uh, Joker becomes God. Okay. <laughs> and he turns Harley Quinn into a fucking constellation of stars. And the thing is, I think that's like one of the nicest things he has done for Harley Quinn in recent mind. So that's kind of depressing. Never get yourself a man like the Joker. Never. This includes Persona 5 Joker. That man's fucking weird. I think he might be an incel. Don't worry about it. What is- what? <laughs> what? Does- what? <laughs> what? Huh? I just broke dragon. What do you mean? Right, are you an incel? Don't worry about it. Do you hate women? Don't worry about it. Oh, I am. I'm quite worried. <laughs> no. <laughs> I am incredibly worried. The answer is just no. in. Self-hating trans woman causes harm to small child's brain. <laughs> <laughs> I am worried, right? Right, you are streaming. No. I said no three times. Oh, I said no. You said don't worry about it. No, I literally said no and, three and then, times. <laughs> and then they said no after that. Oh. Yeah. I, okay. Boss you Mary hurt my brain. Pussy. You hurt the brain. Also, look at. I want you to look at this cat. No. I'm putting in stream planning. Uh, this is the only shiny Pokemon you will ever need. It's not a Pokemon. You don't know. Oh, I think those are bot accounts. Two people started following me on my Tumblr and they're not my friends and I am sad. I, had, I have a shower thought I wish to share. Because before I joined stream, I took a shower, and I am all clean. No. Fuck you. So, here's my shower thought. Okay? Joe Biden has a ha has an apple hat, is T-posing, and is spinning around at five miles an hour. Uh, in a complete, like, uh, just completely spinning horizontally. That is my shower thought. I think, I think the child just made me into anti-free speech hatchet. <laughs> what's what's wrong, hatchet? I don't I don't I don't know what's wrong. What's wrong? What what you. what with what I said? You oh, I know there's something the wrong with me, but you see, that's the thing. I would <laughs> explain to you what's wrong with what you just said, but I'm revoking your free speech, so why should I bother? No, tell that's me it. what's wrong. That's it. Nope, nope. Give me your tongue. <laughs> no. Tongue privileges are revoked. <laughs> tell me what's wrong I'm with Joe Biden in an apple hat spinning horizontally at five miles an hour. Tell me what's wrong with that. Right, please help me revoke the child's tongue. No. What's wrong with T-posing Joe Biden? You don't like Dark Brandon, huh? You don't... You don't like when Joe Biden is baby. <laughs> <laughs> I 
You did not run into that goddamn goat. What? What? Uh, this just in, Hatchet does not like based Biden. That that donkey spinning in <laughs> circles. I think you gave it brain damage. No, that donkey is bite. <laughs> I mean, Biden is kind of an every ass, time, isn't he? Every time anyone talks about Biden, the only thing I can think of is that meme where he says America is and it's just a fumble of words. <laughs> I mean, that is correct. He didn't fuck up that speech. He is right. That is what America is, a fumble of words. Everyone was like, oh, he has dementia. No, he's right. No one knows. No one in America li that lives in America knows what the fuck it is. It's an SCP. We are all trapped here. It's like infinite Ikea, but worse. Some people are trapped in the 1950s, some the 1800s. Everyone here fucking hates each other. Yay! Yay! And there's cats. We have cats. Yay! And dogs. Dogs and cats, that's all we need. And ch I guess Chungus dogs, but they aren't native to the land, so... I don't know. We have those. Don't you love those? We don't have land sharks. I'm sad. Or penguins. We don't Give have penguins. Give me... 10 years. What? Right, if I give you 10 years and you actually develop land sharks, you're gonna be shot by the CIA. <laughs> Why? Like, on site. The CIA does not like land sharks. Can you prove that? Yes. Prove it, then. I am the CIA. This <laughs> is bullshit. I like how Hatchet hasn't uh, said a word as soon as Charles starts speaking. <laughs> wait, no, okay, wait. I'm currently... Uh... I am currently... Trying to find mods. Silence. Land shark mod. Oh, there's actually something I saw that was pretty hilarious, Hatchet. Um, when I saw a Terrorizer play with GTA, and he pulled out the camera for a selfie with the with the horse mask on, mm -hmm. <laughs> that was the first time I saw it, and I don't know what to think about it. <laughs> it's just every time I look at it, I laugh. <laughs> it just looks so incredibly stupid. Okay, I have I have the little thing in the handbook that uh it that's, that they don't like they don't like uh, land sharks. Where? Uh, I'm putting it in stream planning. There. <laughs> I call bullshit. <laughs> no, uh, it, it's totally written by the CIA. I call bullshit. How? How is that bullshit? That, that looks like you just typed it up. I did not just type it. I still see the line for typing. No, you don't. <laughs> the line is Shut right up. There. That's, an, that's a weird looking L. They they sign off all their 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 books with that little weird L. <laughs> bullshit, I can tell. No, it's not bullshit. It is real. You can reverse image search it on Google. You can the, all every member of the CIA uses Google, except for Donald. We don't like Donald. He uses DuckDuckGo. Donald Trump, CIA. <laughs> no, he's just Donald. It's not Donald Trump. He's just Donald. Donald doesn't even actually have a last name. <laughs> yeah, it's just Donald. 
That's actually possible. Yeah, we know. I know. I don't know if Hatchet knows. My lip has cuts in it. What? <laughs> I will not elaborate. Do you, do you have mouth herpes? What? <laughs> <laughs> you have cooties. Hatchet, do you have cooties? Bitch, you do realize that mouth herpes, quote unquote, is literally just cold sores, right? Yeah. Do you have okay. cooties? Considering how cooties is a fictional thing made by children? No. Are you sure? Have you gotten there's checked? A, there's a Netflix movie about that. Yeah, it's a zombie movie. It's pretty funny from what I hear. Mm hmm. I think it's meant to be a comedy, though. It is. You want to know the premise? What? Okay, so the Cooties movie on Netflix. Um, so the premise of the movie is there's a zombie virus that got started by a chicken nugget with some weird goop in it that a girl ate. But the only people that can be infected by the Cooties virus are prepubescent. Ah, fuck. Prepubescent, like, teenagers and children. So. Uh, that's what happens, and it gets an outbreak in a middle school, I think? I think it was a middle school. So, yeah, hell reigns. It was either in a- yeah, I know it was a middle school. Yeah. So hell reigns, and there are only two surviving children left uh, out of the whole school, and they have to help the teachers and shit live. There's actually surprisingly, uh, like, really good, lo uh, really good uh, gore effects. One of the gym teachers gets torn limb from limb, and then the kids play with his limbs. Like his intestines and shit. That's fine. Kind of fucked up. But yeah. You know, it might have been an elementary school. I think it was an elementary school from what I yeah, saw. Yeah, no, yeah, it was an elementary school. Never mind, it wasn't a middle school. Isn't that fun? Isn't that funny? Don't, don't you love the idea of that? Eat egg sandwich. Eat egg sandwich. Egg sandwich doesn't give me fi uh, fire encounters. Eat egg. Egg. Eat Pokemon mm. eggs? Sure. <laughs> Lemon, it's time to make your yourself appetizing for dragons. Make baby. Lemon's a male. They would need a female. <laughs> I know. Shame him. I do as I please, bitch. He is the one killing all the little freaks of nature walking around. Also, if you throw. Okay, actually, before you make that sandwich, okay. Okay, step closer to that cliff. Roll a ball off of it. Roll a ball off of it. What hell? No, no, no. Roll, roll a ball. I can't- I don't have a ball! Yeah, you do! See, uh... ZR. 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 <laughs> Bramble gas, no! <laughs> Bramble gas, lemon! <laughs> oh, Bramble gas is gone. <laughs> Bramble gas is gone. What? Bramble gas went off the side of the cliff to get the ball. <laughs> and I think Gyarados is trying to kill you. Yeah, if you keep throwing the ball off the cliff, the Pokemon will follow. There goes Lemon. Okay. <laughs> you really need to get your Pokemon a therapist, I, I think. Yeah. Wait, where's Bramblegast? Bramblegast's fucking dead. Like, literally. Just dead. Look, look, the Chonk and... <laughs> Gardevoir's like, nah, I'm done with this. <laughs> They're sweeping. I like how Gyarados is such a big bitch, you could still see him all the way down there. Up, oh, oh, no, fuck. That, they're awake now. Up, oh, and they're- I wanna wait, see the Wait, fall. Gyarados is flying! 
<laughs> Hatchet, um, you might want to see this. I am currently in the middle of something. And I'm screenshotting that. Go back. Up, oh, he's falling. He's like, fuck this shit, I'm going home. Oh god, oh god. I fell. So now you can make your Pokemon throw themselves off cliffs. Let's see. Uh <laughs> He's tired of your shit. Why am I not throwing the ball? There you go. I'm just eating milk Hershey's milk Miss... chocolate chips from the bag. Can I stop whistling and throw the ball? It's ZR. I'm hitting ZR. Are you? There it goes. And there goes the ball. Okay, so I will be right back. I have to go do some stuff. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to stop doing this and actually make the fucking sandwich. Dragon wasting my time. I'm gonna go get tea. No. I hope you know I replaced your uh, olive oil with piss. I don't have olive oil, but okay. What's that yellow stuff? Butter. I hope you know I replaced all your butter with frozen piss. How do you know I actually use butter, not olive oil? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Glorious. children we also go God damn it, lemon. Wonder when I'll get a shiny Lumo. Where that day will be. Oh. 
the fuck? Croissant! Can you call people on the road town town? What? Can you call like people, uh, your friends on the road town town? I don't, I don't, I don't know what the fuck I mean. In the game! Oh. Here. Kill. 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 Kill the babies. One, one must be blue. Until baby blue. Just you said that I'm not killing them. Imagine you get a shiny. All right. I'm sitting down to lunch. Child, <laughs> you have three guesses to guess what very, like, very, very American food I have. Cheeseburger. Nope. Uh, ramen? That's I Chinese. said a very American food. Ramen is not Chinese, Bright. I said Japanese. Japanese. I said nope. Japanese. I said Japanese. I heard Bright say Japanese. God damn it! I heard Chinese. <laughs> okay, let, I'll I'll just be nice to you and ignore that guess. You still have two okay. guesses. Uh, okay. Can you give me a hint besides it being American? Like, what what's in it? It is meat based. It is like uniquely American. Billy cheesesteak. No, one more guess. Um, uh, it, uh, think ballpark foods. Hot dog. Hot dog. It is not a hot dog. Well, almost. Chili dog. No. Chili dogs are hot dogs, you dumb bitch. It does involve a hot dog. I have no idea. Oh, is it a corn dog? There you go. I'm having corn dogs. It's a hot dog with extra steps. It's a hot dog, except wrapped up in a blanket. <laughs> it's a pig in a blanket. Also, bright fun Honestly. fact: Have you gotten Have you gotten the flying Pikachu yet? From the yeah. mystery gift? No. Uh, yeah, I evolved it to Raichu. Why would you do that? Because I'm an asshole. <laughs> well, I have the Pikachu now, and he's level 26 because I've just been killing the racist bird. Over and over in a pit. I don't even want a shiny racist bird, but I've just been enjoying killing them. I love seeing my little blue egg bounce around and murder things. That is valid. She's so happy. So carefree. Her blood, her hands are covered in blood. But yeah, like earlier today, I'm thinking I wanna I wanna play some Skyrim. I have an idea for a character I think would be fun to play. Corn dog. But then, like in doing so, I realize oh yeah, like every other time I spend a little bit away from Skyrim, I need to update like the majority of my mods and my mod list, which I... takes forever. I really want to get uh I really want to get Elder Scrolls Oblivion because it's not only cheaper. But the mods are hilarious, and it looks like shit, and it's so funny. I mean, for the time, it was really good. Yeah, I, I, I've seen people play the game. It's, like, really fun, I've heard. And, like, the customization and shit is really fun. And, like, yeah. But yeah. it's... You know? You get to kill giant dudes. The only game I've ever seen mods for that wasn't Minecraft... Uh, was Fallout 76, I think it is called? And there was this mod where, uh, no, uh, the only clothes you can wear is underwear, including NPCs and well monsters. Then. That's not very. That's not a very good strategy for survival in a post-apocalyptic world. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 Hatchet, you're wrong. You want to know why you're wrong? You see, th how that's a great idea is if you show everyone besides what's under your underwear. Uh, the monsters will be so freaked out that you're a nudist in a fucking post-apocalyptic world that they will run. The monsters also wore underwear. Most of the monsters are nude. They gave them underwear. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they became, like, quote-unquote civilized. Yeah. They thought it was the ability to love that made us human. 
in actuality, it was our underpants. Also, wait, if the ability to love, like, is it romantically or whatever? Or is it just the ability to love? I don't know. It's just a dumb meme that I've heard. But yeah, it, it's normally just like not taking into account the nuance of modern understandings of attraction. Wait, no, would that make all, like, aromantic or asexual people, would that make them, like, transformers? The fuck? Are you an Autobot, Bright? No, Decepticon. Oh, fuck. The thing that I learned about that, though, is, like, uh, like, on an Ace Memes thing from OT, there was a moment where, uh, an Ace was responding to that, by pointing out that probably the most likely explanation as to uh, the thing that eventually like heavily made us human and come into what we are now is cooking. Yeah. We're the only animals in nature to cook. We're the only animals that specifically enjoy uh, cooked food better than raw variants, and even more so cooking as a process likely gave humans an advantage in developing a, a bigger brain structure. So, yeah. so if I teach snakes to cook, they can become smarter. Yeah. Feasibly. Of course, you have the big, um, the big hurdle there of the thing that made cooking so easy for us is opposable thumbs. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Actually, actually, you're wrong, Hatchet. The thing is, scientists have been taking it upon themselves to give snakes legs. Yeah. I mean, I have seen, like, that video of someone giving snakes, like, robotic legs. Even though snakes, some snakes actually do have legs, they just don't use them. Yeah, I have legs and arms, and I am a very much human. I am not five penguins in a trench coat and a cowboy hat. Oh, I am shit. not. Right. I am not. Uh, <laughs> like, all snakes have vestigial organs that are, like, what used to be their legs. Yeah. Yes. I don't there... know from personal experience, but I do know that. Wait, does that mean Jerry doesn't have legs? That doesn't- that means Jerry doesn't have arms! Are you just now coming to this realization? No, I'm telling- uh, Bright is like, worried about legs, I'm worried about the hands and arms. Because well, Jerry's an artist, Bright. and you kinda need those. Bright's sending it. Bright's typing a message to Jerry as we speak, isn't he? You don't have legs or arms? <laughs> I feel like because Jerry is a snake, that probably counts as something very offensive. <laughs> Good job, Bright. Bright's being snake racist. <laughs> Shut up. Snake racist. Are you a snake racist? Hmm? No. Your best friend is a snake. <laughs> Right! Wow. 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 <laughs> I had to say that. I had to. Wow. I can't believe my mother is a snake racist. Why well, a regular mother is a racist. Yeah, my yeah. actual birth giver is a racist. So, you know, I, I prefer the snake racist over the actual one. It's almost as if one of those positions is extremely toxic and the other one is a meme. Yeah! <laughs> it's almost like one actually affects people and the other one is snake racism. Uh. I didn't get as much sleep as I meant to last night because I logged on to Twitter for like five seconds and then I was there there for an hour. Why? I don't, do you I think? don't even have a Twitter. What'd you say? 
I thought you didn't have a Twitter. What? I'm pretty sure we follow each other. No, I don't follow you, and I'm pretty sure you said don't follow you because you retweet women. Oh, yeah, in, that's right. Yeah. Dumbass. Well, I don't retweet underwear. women. I don't retweet the naughty stuff for the most part. He could comment on the naughty stuff. Oh. But yeah, like, if you follow me, then there's a higher likelihood that it'll show up on your timeline. Yeah. Pika is so nice! Because I've only seen it twice, thankfully, the, where P Pika commented on, like, you know, ladies getting money. Uh, if you- yeah. Y you probably- yeah. Uh, but he's so nice about it! So it's like, oh god, ass in my face. But then, like, Pika's just being so fucking wholesome, and it's like, God damn it, Pika! <laughs> Why are you so wholesome?! He is so nice! It's in the comments, actually, he's like, holy shit, that's a really cool tattoo! And it's like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's so fucking nice! And... He is not nice to me, and I am sad. That's the shield really being the dirtiest among us is also one of the most wholesome among us. Which Wait, is weird. I have a, I have a theory. Once Dragon turns 18, she will be nice to them. That insinuates some really creepy stuff. Uh, I would prefer Pika still be mean to me. <laughs> to think of it, yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, the thing is that uh, Pika isn't me. It wouldn't be changing that because. Uh, oh, fuck, Pika being change. a creepo, Pika would be changing that because you are no longer a child. Good point. Also, I found a black shiny. I don't care, I'm busy. Getting come here, little, come here, little, little piggy. You're adorable, oh my god! Even, even though canonically, you will always be the child. That is your official ch title. I found shiny baby. What should I name the shiny baby? Holy shit, stop Stop not bouncing, you're gonna fucking explode. In fact, I dare you, if at some point you're able to properly, like, go about the legal process of changing your name, to do chosen name, the child, as your middle name, and then the last name you want. I don't know if I could do that. I do kind of want to change my middle name, because it is, uh, my middle name does have something to do with my grandma. You can change your, uh... Full on name for 50 bucks in my state. That's a lot of money. I don't have that. That is very minuscule towards other states where it's like hundreds of dollars. My state just right. 50 bucks. Right. Yes. I am child with no job. 50 is a lot. Well, wish for money on Christmas. <laughs> What does shiny evolve spoink look like? Is it a good shiny? I don't think it's a good shiny. Cause right now he has a little little black orb on his head, like a little cutie patootie that he is. I just thought of what would be like one of the funniest ways to get at and annoy like a transphobic parent. What the fuck did you send me? Whenever you can watch that, it's just really fucking funny. Okay. Um a really funny way to get back at like a transphobic parent like they they still like feel obligated to give you like say christmas money and you come back and met like at a later time and mention hey thanks for the christmas money you paid for my you paid for my name change <laughs> yeah because usually you like with the uh, holiday specifically if your family's gonna give you money it's usually like a good sum of money yeah like, my mom gave me 50 bucks for Christmas, and 20 of it went toward, uh, some stuff- Oh no, 30 of it went towards some stuff that I shall not be describing. <laughs> um, 20 of- uh, I, I got another $20 from my, uh, Uncle Wes. And now, like, I'm very close to being able to get a $50 gift card off of the, like, uh, paid gaming app on my phone so i will be able to drop like about 90 dollars on uh, various things that i cannot describe uh from steam as long as it's not racist 
I was gonna say the name, but I just I just come to the realization I can't say the name of the game because it is in fact 18 plus. But I keep seeing it on my like, hey, you should get this game because it's a it's a dating sim game. Oh, never mind. Oh wait. Oh, I think I know what it is. Honey. Pop. I don't think you do. You know, I'm gonna skip the word. It's uh woo. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll replace the word. Woo who with mustache man too. Oh, I thought it was Honey Pop for a second. <laughs> it's worse. It's I, so much worse. I already own all of the games from Honey Pot Studios. Yeah, the game. I I feel like the game that keeps. Oh fuck it. The thing is, I feel I like do... the game I mentioned is far worse. The thing is, I do want to play that game, Honey Pop. But the thing is, I want to. I want to act as Laffy when playing it, and they have no idea what the game's about. Oh. Yeah. And that would be funny as shit. Unless I'm confusing Honey Pop for a different game series, isn't that the one with, like, where they have a trans character, but, like, it's... Whoa. she's, like... Uh... What? I, I think I'm thinking of something else. Never mind. I don't know of any trans characters that are problematic in Honey Pop. Like, Honey Pop 1, as far- like, that's the only game I've played so far, and it definitely, as far as I know, doesn't have trans characters. I think it was the second one. Yeah, it's Honey Pop, uh, 2 Double Date. Oh yeah, uh, that one. I have yet- I have yet to play. What's- what's- what's the problematic character? What's going on? Well, it's not this character herself, to my knowledge, but it's like, it's the fact that they straight up changed one feature. Uh, because transphobic gamer bros. Like, changed it to... Uh, you can, uh, choose parts of her. Because transphobic gamer bros. I mean, I don't know. That doesn't seem, like, too transphobic. They only added because... it because of the transphobic gamer bros. Is it that it was solely because of the transphobic game yes. bros, or is it? Will you let me finish my statements? <laughs> but it, it is. That's why th the thing. Uh, let me j let Hatchet finish. Ah. What I'm trying to say is that within a game that surrounds this stuff, it kind of makes sense if you have the option to choose what parts a character has. It's an aspect of being more open to, uh, attraction. Yeah, but it's, it's more of a and, fact that... And in that case, that's not necessarily erasing the trans character. That's basically just putting a different set of parts onto the trans character. It, it's, it's not more as of if the they fact got that... rid of the trans character. It's more of the fact that the only reason they kind of added it was not because of, you know... But because transphobic gamer bros were like they they weren't gonna buy it unless they added that. I mean, granted, that is kind of scummy, but also I mean. And then there's there are other issues with kind of characters being very stereotypical, but I don't know. It's it's a video game where you get to see boobs. But, uh, it's weird. <laughs> also, I have encountered six hundred and sixty-six numal. Oh. I am now ready to summon Satan. What? Haste. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> when you summon Satan, I better be there. That fucker owes me money. <laughs> gambling money? Is Satan no. a gambler? No. As oh. we all know, um, yeah. as we all know, atheists have attacks, like, are taxed by the devil. For being atheists, like to have like a, a paid atheist subscription. Now that I'm no longer an atheist, I want my money back. Counter argument. No. No money return. This is between me and Satan. Fuck off. <laughs> I am Satan's tax collector. Whoa. Satan is Mr. Beast. Um, 
And we all know what's wrong with Mr. Beast. And yeah, he's not gonna give you your money back. I don't You're know what's fucked. wrong with Mr. Beast. I, I've literally never given a single shit about that man. Exactly. Well, you're not getting your money back. Fuck you. Eat shit. <laughs> but yeah, like, on the topic of Honeypot, I think that, like, it is definitely problematic in certain areas. Like, let's just be frank, like, most popularly available, uh, like, adult really games. popular adult games. Yeah. Um, specifically, I think it's pro- I would be willing to guess, like, based upon what I remember of certain characters, um, there is a bit more, uh, leaning into characters, uh, uh, race and nationality than is kind of comfortable. For instance, like, to get on a character's good side, it commonly comes down to getting them very specific special gifts that's special to them and those gifts commonly are related to uh just their nationality or their ethnicity which is kind of eh. granted i think it's also kind of on the nose because like there are moments in which the characters like jokingly call the player character racist for like focusing on getting them shit like that like there's a there's one Japanese girl that when you get her something that is uh, Japanese in origin, she she will just uh, her her response will simply be, <laughs> "You are so racist." Like tongue think, in cheek, kind of. Yeah, like I I think it's a touch problematic, but it's it's not nearly as bad as it could be, basically. It's not bad as bad as uh woohoo with you know who two. You Wait don't a minute. Know. Wait a minute. I wasn't picking up on this. Is woohoo with you know who is you know who? Mustache the, man? The the German party guy? Yep. There's two oh games of God. that motherfucker, oh my. and I what keep the... getting the second one recommended, and I don't know why. I don't like it. It scares me. Burn it down. I know. Burn it, I'm pretty sure it's, it it's probably down. like supposed to be like tongue in cheek and making fun of the guy, because oh, like Adolf fuck Hitler? him. <laughs> don't say the motherfucker's you're name. He is who face. shall not be named, motherfucker. Dumbass. You're gonna get yourself banned. We're trying to be considerate of the fact that you are streaming. <laughs> and you are going to get yourself banned. No, Bright, 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 you don't have not only enough subs, but the ass di the, the diameter of your ass will not save you from being banned. What? Because Twitch, a lot of Twitch mods, like big mods that, you know, own the site are perverts. So, they won't save you. And we are trying to make sure you don't get banned, but you're trying to get yourself banned. <laughs> but yeah, a lot, of the, a lot of the big owners of Twitch are creepy. That actually makes me wonder, like, what if we had someone do an experiment where they come onto Twitch and do a whole bunch of things that are, like, mildly offensive to Twitch staff, but they're also a booby streamer? Like, how would- how would Twitch react to that? I'm sure there are some people on the staff that like being degraded. <laughs> <laughs> like, comes on and starts saying the quote-unquote C-slur that- that Twitch has a lot of issues with. Oh, that took me a moment, because I was like, wait, what? Oh, yeah, the- the, yeah, the no, salty the, goodness snack? The- the supposed C-slur. Yeah. Even though there is actually a sea slur used against Chinese people, but apparently I don't think, if I remember correctly, they haven't actually banned anyone from saying that slur, which is kind of fucked up. Incredibly fucked up. I think I'm, I know what I'm you're just talking gonna, about. I, I don't know what that slur is, and you know what, I think I'm fine with that for the moment. It, it's, you know, it's not a word. That It's not even a word. It's not even close to sounding like a word. So I think you're fine. 
Because I, I, I learned about them like, oh, yeah, if anyone ever says that, it, that is not a word. That is straight up just, that's just would only it, it ever be used with as a sink, slur. Right? Huh? It rhymes with sink. Uh, yeah. And yeah, I know what it is. I didn't know it was a slur, but then again, you hear it and it's like, yeah, there's no way that is like a word. So it, it's very obvious. Yeah, um... The reason I know that word is because Van also said it a couple times. Oh no. <laughs> he's, uh, isn't he, he Chinese is, Canadian? Yeah, yeah, he's Chinese Canadian. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, fair. fair I remember I, I watched one of his videos in the first five seconds he said it, and I'm like, wait a fucking minute. Oh wait, he's, he's, he's Chinese Canadian. It's good. <laughs> yeah, he's been trying it... for the past couple of weeks to get himself canceled, <laughs> and it's failing. <laughs> I, because, yeah. like, everyone in his audience knows that he is not a white man. Yeah. And he's saying stuff that would only offend people of his same race. And everyone who watches him knows he is of that race. So they're like, they don't really give a fuck. Yeah. Also, it's not involving being weird to children. So I feel like everyone's kind of just, like, kind of glad it's not dealing with children. <laughs> Side eyes, mini lad. They still make fun of them in videos. Good. Good. He really deserves it. I still found it funny when mini lad apologized to everyone he's worked with. <laughs> Nicholas said, "Yeah, I hope you're doing well. I hope everything goes well for you." Uh, by the way, I'm taking the meme string. <laughs> just took, just outright said I'm taking your shit from you. Hell yeah. <laughs> I'm I just killed a Lucario and now I'm I'm killing Rylos. Fuck fuck them kids, I'm killing them. You're gonna be an you're an orphan now and now I'm killing you. So now you're gonna be an orphan of life. Dragon, no, you're supposed to throw them in an orphanage, then set the orphanage on fire. You get- you kill more than- Oh, wait, I do have a Pokemon named Orphanage. Should I throw Orphanage at the children? <laughs> Did you throw an Orphanage at the children? <laughs> uh, yeah, I have a dr uh, dust- uh, drift- drift- a drift blimp, uh, named Orphanage. <laughs> no, just you say, should I throw it in Orphanage? At the children. Yeah, should I? What the fuck is my friends group? Uh, we do not. I I don't know. We don't have we don't have brain cells. We no. do not. Hello, yes, hello, Twitch chat. We do not actually condone the throwing of orphanages at all. Or I do. I condone it. The thing. Is you know how how hard it is to find an orphanage nowadays. A good orphanage. No, what I'm starting to think, it, uh, what picture in my mind was just a really small ass penguin picking up a giant building <laughs> that's like an orphanage and tossing it at a child. What do you mean? I did, I have done that. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, back to what I was initially saying. No. Like, I got trapped on Twitter last night. And it was entirely because my brain went down a rage trap up seeing uh the fact that hashtag pronouns was trending uh -oh. so i click on that and it's literally nothing but people freaking out over being asked to be decent human beings and respecting other people at one point there was even a turf that was like equating like expecting someone to say their pronouns to living in uh no fun time germany and saying the hh thing it uh what hail yeah yeah the hh is usually what people use as a dog whistle for uh yeah yeah i know that but it's also, the only way I could think of quickly to describe the the phrase. 
Which is why uh, when people when uh, Harry Styles put HH on his merch, a lot of people freaked out and were like, "Hey, dude, don't do that!" And when he shortened uh, his, uh, I think it was like he called his brand Harry House, and he always shortens it down to HH. A lot of people freak out and go like, "Hey, you're a grown man. We've said this many times. Don't use the fucking that. Don't use that abbreviation." Yeah. Harry Styles. Yes. The people are like, oh, he's so cool, he, he he breaks gender norms. No, the fuck he doesn't. Wow, he wore a dress once. Oh my god. Who gives a fuck? Still like the fact that... I, I think the best thing that has ever come out of Dan Schneider's career is the fact that Dan Schneider had One Direction come onto iCarly and then specifically decided to write Harry Styles as an absolute piece of shit. I feel like I remember that episode, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Harry Styles just like demands that he like he starts faking being sick so that he can get a, a like a whole bunch of free shit from Carly and live in her li live in her room for like a week which is also like the most fan fictiony thing i can think of but it also is just like yeah yeah they just they wrote Harry Styles to be an absolute piece of shit perfect I'm evolving Spoink. I'm gonna see if it's a good shiny. If it's not, I'm reverting it. Every time I hear the name Spoink, I am filled with guttural rage. It's a good shiny. Never mind. Teeter dance. Here, I'll, I'll let you, you, you piss, you piss pig. I'll let you learn teeter dance. <laughs> okay, there you go. What should I name Piss Pig? Piss Pig. Yeah. Technically, he's called Grum Pig, but I'm gonna. Yeah, he's he's a little pink rat boy. Hello. I could name him Cop. Piss Cop. Also, Hatchet, this round thing right here that we we were wondering what it is. It's a it's a potato tortilla. I had to right. say it like that. I, I know right. it's tortilla. I know it's tortilla. I had to say it like that as American just like start sending out the we we need to have like png that's like jiri's <laughs> avatar being projected onto the clouds <laughs> calling <laughs> jiri signal it let me call piss pig piss pig <laughs> i spelled a p-i-s-s -S pig and it let me piss piss pig lives Piss Pig is running around me. He is insanely adorable. Actually, I like I like Grump Pig shiny. I got a lot of shiny Grump Pigs uh, in Ultra Sun. Sandwich is beautiful, and you cannot say otherwise, Hatchet. What? Your sandwich looks like you intentionally created the Leaning Tower of Pisa. That's actually what it looks like in the picture. <laughs> your sandwich looks like your intestines. Lopsided and extremely unhealthy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and apparently on fire. <laughs> he went to Taco Bell. Bright goes to Taco Bell. I've actually been to Taco Bell before. I feel like most Americans have. That's yeah, okay. Oh wow, how how unique Bright. Oh my god, Bright went to Taco Bell. Holy oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. I kind of want to eat at Taco Bell again. Because when I went for one time, I didn't get upset stomach. And the food was actually okay. Yeah. I never got upset stomach. I, I have a pretty Taco sensitive Bell, stomach. I should remember, if I remember correctly, Ranbu uh, has actually, uh, I think in the past, has had la late streamed because he ran to Taco Bell. Or like drove to Taco Bell. But, uh, yeah. And he, he, he wanted Taco Bell before stream. 
Motherfucker, I'm gonna choke you. Oops. I'm going to obliterate your goddamn family. I'm gonna wipe you off the fucking planet, you motherfucker. Oh yeah, Bright. Um, when, when, or how long are you planning to stream? Not long. Just three more minutes. Oh, that's really short. That's a really short stream. I have a night shift. Oh yeah, you gotta go get sleep. Because you're an adult who has to do an adult thing. Isn't that fun? Don't you love doing adult things? Well, if I was still a child, we wouldn't be talking right now. What? I said if I wasn't, a, if I was a child, we wouldn't be talking right now. We I, never I, you met didn't it. learn to talk until you were 18. No, because we wouldn't have met Dragon. Yeah, that's kind of how that, that, that. Yeah, that's kind of how the past works. Yeah. Obama Snow is adorable. The Snover is adorable. Missives by Iron Dusk. What? Missives by Iron Dusk. Uh, I don't. Huh? Magical College of Winterhold. Eric Stops of Skyrim. Isn't there an orc in there? No. What? The, the librarian, isn't he at work? Oh, yeah, there's an orc. <laughs> Your first response to me mentioning the, the College of Winterhold is, isn't there an orc in there? Yeah. My library has a giant centipede and a few crab spiders. What? Good for you. That's the act. That's actually true with the, oh, with the Wonders Library. That the giant centipede and a bunch of crab spiders. They're called librarians. What the fuck did you send me? I don't want to know. What? I'm not watching video? that video. No, it's watching. actually really funny. It, it, it's based off the chunk. In a really Where funny is... way. Where is the racial body? Oh wait, it is! Yeah, dragon, I didn't see Fuck you, eat shit, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, die, die, fuck you. Well damn, dragon, I didn't know you thought about me that way. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I need the racial body morphs! What? <laughs> No context. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> There's no context for that, and that's amazing. Oh, yeah, what, what is the context of that? Will not be elaborating. No, please do. <laughs> it just sounds like you said something incredibly fucked up. Also, you know why AI art can't replace can't replace artists? You want to know why? Because I, on my, I, on my, mind you, this is titled, Could AI Make This? And on my Tumblr dash right now is Gandalf with some giant bonkers. Giant melons. Honker badonkers. Gandalf, but as a woman. No, no, he very much is still not, he, he has a beard and all. He's a women, can beards. women can yeah, have women beards. Women can have beards. Yeah, women can I know women can have beards. I love fucking, women with beards. But also, like, I know. Fucking supposed connoisseur of women over yeah. here. <laughs> not understanding that women can have beards. <laughs> Fuck you. No, women can have beards, but I don't think they intended Gandalf to be in this, uh, to be a woman. Just, he just had big honkers. He hasn't had top surgery. He just has big honkers. Gandalf pre-top surgery. But what if Gandalf is actually just gender fucked? Good point. Do you, should I send you the Gandalf? It's not too inappropriate, but his honkers are slightly out. Do you do go you ahead, wish to I see guess. the Gandalf? Sure, go ahead. But yeah, the racial body morphs mod is one that uh, basically. Um, uh, it, it basically gives all the races of 
Skyrim a more lore accurate scaling to how their uh, body types are in lore. Mm -hmm. So, like, for instance, uh, like, within the base game, like, there's very minor differences between various races in how tall on average they are, how broad they are, that stuff. But this makes it more noticeable, which I tend to appreciate. Yay. For instance, Bo for instance, Bosmer, the Wood Elves, are fucking tiny. But, like, in, in the base game, they're just, like, maybe on average a couple inches shorter than the Nords, one of the tallest races. And don't even get me started on the Altmer. How large are the orcs? Uh, they are the second tallest and by far the thickest race. Can I see an orc woman? No. May I uh, see an orc woman? Uh, it might be hard to find a good image. I'll, I'll try to Give me orc women. I wish to see strong orc women. You're not allowed, dragon. I would say, what are, are you, you my mom, but you... <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. You played yourself. Yeah. Because, yeah. I keep seeing Gan pictures of Gandalf. I'm gonna keep sending you pictures of Gandalf on my Tumblr. I think it's all like the art same artist. Yeah. No, it's no. not. Fuck huh? you. What, what do you? What do you? What do you? What do you think, Hatchet, of the Gandalf? Skeletons. I am currently trying to figure out where to put this in my load order. It's... Oh, that's a dog. I don't think that's a cat. Okay. Sure. Or a bat. I can't read. Job. Oh, your, your American education failed you. It failed us all. You know... There's an entire you... subset... Like, there's an entire massive subsection of the American population that learned extremely basic dumbed down biology and assumed that's all that there was for biology also bright i quite literally know where you live what are you talking about i <clears throat> I, I i i quite literally know where you live send me i know your address send me a picture of rick uh rick astley as proof then Okay. Here, I'll send you a picture of Rick Astley. Did you know Rick Astley is British? And you hate British people. Uh, dragon, I meant... <laughs> in the mail. <laughs> Should I attach a note where so your parents could say I, my, my handwriting looks like a 12-year-old? Just have it typed up in a... A word document and print it. <laughs> you can't shame me if I don't write anything. They can't shame me if, if, if I make it cryptic and I attach letters from the newspaper that I do not read. <laughs> but, Just do the serial killer thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here's a picture of Rick Astley. The only message is, I see you. <laughs> I would send that to someone and just never mail them again. <laughs> <laughs> no return address either. Yeah. No, no, what if, okay, what if I send someone a note and it's like all the cryptic letter thing and it's like the next package you get is going to be a pipe bomb with no return address and I never send the pipe bomb because I don't know how to make a pipe bomb. It's that like a very... That's a very surefire way to get arrested. Yeah. Mm -mm. They not if there's not a return address. They can still track where a package came from. It's not a package, it's a letter. Or a letter. They can still track it. Uh-uh. Not if I... Yes, they can. How do you uh -uh. think that they caught the people who were sending 
government officials anthrax. Why were they sending government officials anthrax? Because they were terrorists. <laughs> yes. This happened right around the 9-11 attacks. Oh. Uh. Like packages can still be tracked without a return address. Good point. Also, uh, what are your opinions on, on Gandalf? On, I I mean, it's it's boob Gandalf. <laughs> I am neutral. <laughs> Right, do you want to see Boob Gandalf? I really don't care. Okay, so that is that a yes or a no? That's your answer. I really don't care. I'm sending you Boob Gandalf. Okay. Also, I, I need to point out Guard of War's level. Is it 69? Really? Is it 69? It is, it is you're both, it? You're both immature. It is. You're what right, put, her in the, <laughs> oh, put him in the box. Put him in the box. What? Why? Eris, put him in the box so he stays that way forever. No, fuck you. Fuck you! It's my, one of my team members. I'm going to get them all to level 100, bitch. Ooh, fuck you, goat. Goat woman. <laughs> Lemon sat on that Numel and <laughs> then killed it. N uh, I, 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 what? Lemon sat I, on the I new one. I think you just it. broke the child's brain. Is does lemon have a fat ass? I mean, look at that tail. <laughs> that is not an ass. I don't know how to how to tell you that. But it's an ass attachment. <laughs> yeah. A tail is but ass gear. Why are you playing lobsters? Because I can. I must fight against the lobsters. <laughs> no, not the shrimp. Shrimp. Now they're just swimming. It's just a sea of red crustaceans to the side. I'm gonna win for oh, the pictures. Here. All I'm seeing is bearded women. That is Gandalf. I'm seeing a bearded woman. That is Gandalf. A bearded woman. That's Gandalf. Bearded woman. That is Gandalf. Bearded woman. That is Gandalf. Oh my god, you two, shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's Gandalf! The bearded woman. Right, I love bearded women, but that is... That's Gandalf. It's a bearded woman. I'm gonna put this in stream planning. This is what I want to... This is how I'm gonna grab Bright. <laughs> the bearded woman. <laughs> That is Gandalf! It's a bearded woman. <laughs> Here, I'll settle it. Gandalf is a bearded woman. There. I still see as a bearded woman. Motherfucker! <laughs> Why can't she be both? Wait. <gasps> yes! Before yeah, stream ends! Grab! Before stream ends! Fuck Grab, yeah! Baby! Oh, wait, wait. Save, 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 save. encounters. Oh, wait, 882 encounters. Oh, it's a girl too. Oh, it's a it's a llama. And it's caught. Llama. What are you gonna name her? Nothing. Oh, could you please name her? You should name Can her name Insider her Trading. You should name her Batman. Name her Insider Trading. <laughs> too what late. the fuck is Insider Trading? A crime. I think. Uh, at least it's not insider trading of genetics. What? <laughs> Did I break you? Did what I break your brain? What is that supposed to mean? How do you think blue people with blue eyes came to be? That is what insider tr trading of genetics is. You're literally just describing evolution, I guess. 
I'm, I'm, you know what? I'm not gonna explain it. I'm gonna just keep, I'm, you know what? It's funnier if I don't explain. Basically, what I'm probably gonna do, since I already got the shiny for Numel, I'm just gonna find where the next area for shiny would be. And mm -hmm. in strength. Yay! Yeah! I kind of want to buy a game for... Grimace. Oh, should I buy Doki Doki Literature Plus? I don't know. Eh. Kind of something more action-y. I mean, I'm gonna be getting some stuff that's more action-y, but, uh... <laughs> yeah, it's not that Yeah, kind of yeah, action. we get it. Ha 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 ha. I have problems. We know. We know. We know. Why does it look like your bramble ghast is carrying a lemon seed? Because it is. It, it improves oh, so their grass type moves. Also, I can't believe bramble ghast has been on your team all game and you have not leveled it up. Or not, not leveled it up, uh, named it. Because I like its name. Fair point. You could have named it Ripple Tilt Skin. Ripple Stilt Skin. Fuck Why you. Why would I name it that? Because you can. And you should. And you would. You should have named it Rampled Romp Stomped. <laughs> what the fuck? Ooh, Horizon Zero Dawn, but I haven't played the first game. Hmm. Women. Now we got the dancing bird on stream. Women. Uh huh? Women. Women. Oh. Okay, so now we need to find out where Oricorio is. Ori Corio, uh, the yellow one, because it doesn't really matter if you get the yellow or the red one, you can change the form. But yeah. the yellow one is at the bottom where you start spawn, and the red one is closer to the top, if I remember correctly. Well, I'm still. Oh, yeah. It's the bird that evolves into something that makes me, uh, think things. Ori Cario is... is the dancing bird. Yes, I see that. It doesn't evolve. Yeah, it doesn't evolve. What the fuck are you on? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what then? What was that picture? The one down there? That's a different form. Yeah, the red one. That's, that's a different form. Oh. Well, that's what I was meaning, the red one. There's also a pink one that's a, I think like a hula dancer. And there's a purple one that's, it's a form of dance in, like, traditional dance in Japan. Mm. It's in Japan! I can't do the meme. So it's actually around right here. Around Los Quote Platos. the child. It's a Japan. It's in Japan. Anyway, I, I just oh, go ahead. I just read a title of a game and I misread it as breasts instead of beasts. Oh, I'm a no. dumbass. I'm a fucking dumbass. I can't read. Oh no. Bright, I can't read. I'm aware of that. You Welcome should teach Florida. me Teach me how to read. That is your job as a parent. Fuck you and you're on your own. Fuck you! Fuck you! What I was gonna say is the thing that spurred me to want to play Elder Scrolls Skyrim again. I can't really say it like that. Just Skyrim again. Is I had the idea of a character that is a trans man who is a Nord. Alright. Uh, Dragon, last words go. Um...
Okay, my last words is the word beasts and breasts are far too close to my comfort for being words. Beast breasts. <laughs> All right, catch it. Last, last words go. And remember, kids. Oh. If you're listening to this transmission, it's too late. Oh. Fuck? What? What are you insinuating? Oh no! Data deficient. <laughs> uh oh. Well, it's been nice knowing y'all. <laughs> anyway, my last words are: Did you know that in Europe, breast milk is their currency? The more you know. <laughs> Fun <laughs> fact. Fun fact: All nat, all all milks for uh sourced from animals are breast milk. Right? Is that why you have so much European shit? What? I don't have much <laughs> European shit. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> oh fuck. Anyway, D Danger News. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time in your next mission. <laughs>